Jaya Sab, I would request you to please uh, stay on stage to deliver the closing remarks uh, as representative of Kappa after the group photograph. Jaya Sab, a note of thanks and the closing remarks, please. Well, first of all, uh, Ms. Hina, it's very unfair because in this part of the world, we desperately need a cup of tea after lunch to be alive and look like awakening. Okay, nevertheless, uh, heads off to all the audiences who are still uh, feeling fresh without having a cup of tea. But shortly, I won't, won't take too much of your time. Uh, we will wrap up the session within 10, 15 minutes. And despite the fact that we have started a half an hour late, but we'll close our session dot on time at 5 o'clock. So formally, good afternoon, everyone. Being a, a member on the board of Kappa, I am interested with the duty to have a summing up session on behalf of Manoj Fadness, President Kappa. And I trust you all have found this day to be really fruitful and rewarding in terms of learning. And it's always a pleasure to have our meeting with the eminent speakers, experts who come together at a platform, who share their experiences and the ideas with the rest of the people. The dialogues have been enriching and enlightening in some areas. I will take forward from what I said in my panel discussion. The personally, my litmus test of the success of an event is the question which has been asked online, what's next? What are the action plans that need to be taken? And I will urge you, therefore, as we draw to the end of FRED 3 forum today, ask the same questions, what you will do next. At this point, uh, Kappa wishes to put on record again that it remains keen and will hold fast to its commitment to maintain the freight forum alive and as its key initiative for the accounting profession in the Asia Pacific region. This is consistent with its core mission to develop, coordinate, and advance the accounting profession in the region and for it to act as an inspirational leader. Kappa's commitment to debate and influence the financial reforms in our jurisdiction to facilitate good corporate reporting at the government level and support the role of accountants that, that they should play is steadfast and will remain so for years to come and will continue to support platforms that provide such avenues. Kappa always look forward to a strong, sustainable accountancy profession that will remain relevant and is future ready. A vision that we all can contribute towards. And within that boundary, we spoke the whole day, the technological advancement we needed, the transparency and governance principle we need to observe we need to remain ethical in all sphere of activities or professional jobs we are doing. In terms of what the next Fred look like, I have few questions in my mind. The Kappa envisages that the future Fred forums need to impact decisions of the government, regulators, policy makers, standard setters, and the business leaders. That should be the key takeaway from the Fred 1, 2, and 3. And some, the matter of interest that we may be pondering for the next Fred 4 conference, the idea came to my mind with vis-a-vis uh, -vis the accounting profession. And we have, we should see that, what would it, would it would look like in the 10 years time? Can it still be trusted? Is there adequate supply of accountants? The war of talents. So the, the, these topics may be covered in the next phrase. Accountancy education. Is secondary and tertiary education adequate in the region to support the supply of quality accountants? 
that can be also deliberated. Technology, as we talked about earlier, how do we expect advances such as blockchain and artificial intelligence to impact businesses? What is the extent of cybersecurity risk? Is the accountancy profession ready? Fraud and corruption, what is the extent to the issue? Is the accounting pro profession doing enough? Holistic reporting, as the stakeholders demand more holistic, sustainable, and integrated reporting versus historical and more tra traditional sort of financial reporting, our recent development in the region are on the right track. All those questions need to be answered in the two years' time when we'll be holding the next FRED 4. Further, I would like to highlight the three important publications which we'll be uh, introducing in, in, in December 2018 from the platform of CAPA is the governance. CAPA's work is aimed at squarely strengthening governance within professional accountancy organization, which in itself raises many interesting issues. So the second publication arose from a survey which was carried out by CAPA in 2016 to explore the prevalence of accounting technicians across the region. This work was influenced by comments from others, including the World Bank, who have often cited the need for the accounting technicians to support improved accounting in the public sector and the small and medium practices who could not afford the luxury of the chartered accountants. So interestingly, we note a successful AT style organization in Pakistan being the Pakistan Institute of Public Financial Accountants. Last but not the least, the third publication is a topic close to the CAPA's heart, which is about the professional accountancy organization, which on the topic engaging with the public sector and challenging PAOs to consider if they are sufficiently engaged with the public sector on a number of levels, including having public sector members. So these are all interesting topics and may be suitable in one form of the or the another for future FRED events. So with that, uh, in the end, I would like to thank the organizing committee, all our international delegates, the support extended by the World Bank uh, throughout the conference, a very tedious exercise running along last three to four months. They worked day and night to assemble and gather all of us together to share our views, ideas, experiences, and way forward for the economic development of the region. Finally, I would like to thank our media partners as well, our sponsors who supported us financially, and, and the whole organizing team, secretariats of the, both the institutes, administration and logistic supports we have taken from the SAFA secretariat as well in, 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 in getting all of us together. So thank you very much for, uh, for being part of a very successful FRED 3 conference in Karachi. Thank you very much. Looking forward to see you again. With this, uh, we bring the conference to a close. Uh, I would really like to thank uh, the Secretariat of ICAP, uh, especially Ms. Saira Shamsi. She's responsible for me being here. Uh, the World Bank team, Kurat, Jivenka, um, so, Sukriti, that's, I think, how would I spell your name? or? pronounce your name, Spritri. Uh, excuse me if I'm wrong, but still. Uh, the thanks is heartfelt. Um, Adil and all the rest of the team, there are too many to name, but thank you very much. And uh, with that, uh, we close the event for tea. And uh, I would really request uh, the president, ICAP, ICMAP, with council members and foreign delegates to stay back for photographs. And the rest of the participants, please proceed towards the crystal ballroom for final tea, networking, and then off to your homes. Thank you very much. Allah Hafiz. See you in the next thread. <laughs>